Hi YouTube, today very interesting day, lovely day. So quick drop, Hyundai E40, 12 reg, uh, 17 diesel. Uh, we will replace the engine oil filter and oil, of course. So that's easy. So what's happened now? So remove the cover, be gently. Yeah, there is like one, two, three points, rubber points. So, where is the filter? Filter is exactly here. That's easy to replace. And open the cap. We can check the oil level before. So that's been in case how much was the consumption. Okay. This one is a little bit high. No, there's the maximum. Probably after a few minutes it will be dropped down. So it's fine. Okay, so time to up the car and found the remover oil cap. Okay, let's go. Point of the lift, the car is exactly here, like the others. Here and here. Okay. Don't forget about the safety job. Okay, so the engine oil cap is here. You have to remove this and have a look inside. We see the cap exactly there. So that easy. Okay. Okay, so night 17 socket. Yep. Looks like that. So be ready for the splash. The oil has the aluminium washer. So you don't have to use this every time, but if you have, that's great. Okay, so we leave the oil will be go down. We go to upstairs for removing the oil filter. Just for make space, we remove the dipstick. We disconnect the solenoid, but that's not necessary, but be handy. And we try to find tools for this. So, okay, this is the 27. if you put some cloth on there or you can you can clean up after that's up to you filter looks like that. How to remove this? Just like that. And it's ready to out. Okay, I just prep the new one and we we replace. Okay, so without filter the place looks like that. Very easy. 
All right, guys, so when the oil is stopped dropping, like that, that's been off. So time to put back the cap. All right. Now for wet cleaner drink. Will be great if you clean as well inside and um, the cover as well. Because in the cover is a small part of oil. Be sure you tight it. Keep clean everything. Like this. Alright. What will be best idea if when you remove the filter, throw it on the floor, and will be great idea if you a little bit wash inside. Not too much. Just like that. Because the old door still will be there. That's not like that. Don't forget. Don't forget to replace the the one rubber and second rubber. That's important. Yeah, that's that's the new filter. On. Now time to replace the two, two rubbers. One and two. Okay. So just remove the old one. Fit the new one. Same story with this. Just don't make mistake. Where is the rubber? Okay. Don't try fit in wrong place. Just like that. You can use the old oil for grease the rubber. And now we have the ready set to fit the gun. So we have the set. Green. That's all. Okay, guys. So not too much because the, you don't have to tighten it more like the 35 newtonometers because the seal. This is the rubber, not the plastic. So, okay. So bottom everything is right. Up as well. So now time to add the engine oil and start the engine. Okay, so we use the 5W Torti Low Ash engine oil. This is the best oil for this engine. Premium. Okay. 
Okay, let's see if we have cleaner air. Something else, don't forget. Finish it. Yep. Five liters, that's pure. Hundred percent. Okay. Five point five, I think. And we see after it's, it's impossible to tighten too much because it's click system. That's great. Okay, now it's here, but after start will be of car, of course, lower. Okay. All right, so. Now we wait a few minutes and we check how is the engine oil level. Okay, after a few minutes we check how is the level. Okay, like we see is perfect. We leave like that. So that was 5.5 engine oil. Okay guys, we have to clear the uh, service lights. Now it's 3,271 kilometers to service, but was past the year. Okay, and we go to maintenance. Press the trip. Oh, this is an information. Ho oh, ho. All right. So, can we go to. Oh, yeah. For the next 15,000, we'll be light on the dash. Need service. Okay, so you have to use the display and trip. Going to user and use the, the two buttons for find the information here. Okay, that was not too difficult. Enjoy. Make some mark somewhere when you replace the oil, just for the future. And good luck. See you guys to next video.